Well, Craig, tell me how it went. How was the reunion? Have fun? Well, I gotta tell you, it was the most fun I've had in recent years. I saw so many wonderful people. All people were having fun, getting to know people who didn't see in so long. It was a great time. Okay, Craig, tell me the highlights of the reunion. Tell me what went on, and tell me everything. Well, you know, it started off Friday night at Hector's. Everybody was there. There was about 80 or 90 people there having a great time. Stu McLeod, who owns that place, Gave coupons to everybody for free drinks and started the night off great. It was fun, but man, I tell you, it was so damn hot compared to Arizona. I mean, Arizona, you don't sweat like you do up there. Uh-uh. Well, what happened after Friday night? Or later on that night? Did you have a good time? After Hector's, I went to Redmond followed some girls around like I did in high school. And we finally ended up at the Matador uh, restaurant there and had... A bite to eat and a few drinks. And then we went back to the hotel room. That was fun. Well, tell me. Tell us all. What happened in the hotel room? It's anxious. We're waiting to find out. Come on. But I got to tell you, I got back to my hotel room. The girls went to their room in the other building even. And uh, 10 minutes later, they called me and said, Craig, come over to our room. We want you over here now. So I couldn't stop that, so I went over to their room. <laughs> I took my camera too. When I got there, these girls were dressed up in these great, great pajamas. <laughs> I took pictures and put them on the internet. You can find them right on the homepage there. It was a fun time. <laughs> I won't forget it. Well, what happened next, Craig? You went to the reunion on Sunday or Saturday? How'd that go? Well, I gotta tell you, this reunion was the best ever. And the people, there were so many people there. It had to be 180 people. It was amazing. We had great food, we had great entertainment for music. We had the golf course area, beautiful, beautiful setting. And everybody was friends. Everybody was friends in high school. It's amazing. I won't forget it. We'll do it again in five years. We're gonna try it again in five years, okay? That'll be fun. But uh, I had a great time. And I hope everybody that went there had one too. But I have one thing to say. There was a incident that happened before the reunion that uh, hurt my my feelings that happened. So we had a great group helping with the reunion. Uh, Denise Welch and Karen Frazier were helping me establish the thing and find people. And they were all both gonna come to the reunion. Well somebody sent Karen Frazier an email saying she didn't belong there because she didn't graduate or go with us to all the years in school, which I found totally deplorable. So Karen took it at heart and didn't come. And I want to apologize to Karen. You should, should have come. You should not stay at home. It was a stupid, stupid email they sent you to do that. And I'm, I'm so sorry about that. And uh, whoever sent that email to Karen to tell her that was totally stupid. I can't believe so petty person would do that. Petty. And again, Karen, I'm really sorry for you. And, and I'm sure everybody else in the reunion says, it's, Karen, I'm sorry. And you did a lot of work for us. You did all the mailings for us. You paid for the mailings, stuff like that. And how people can say that, I don't know. But I'm, it was deplorable. But anyway, sorry. <laughs>